Hey guys, how's it going to Pocket? In this video, I'm going to show you how to downgrade Android 7 back to Android 6 on any Samsung device. So let's get started. First, go to your computer and then to your browser and then go to Samsung.com to download Smart Switch or you may find the link in the description. After that, install it and then open the software. Then connect your device. After that, click on the backup button and then backup all of the data on your device. Remember, when we're going to downgrade to Android 6, all of the data will be removed. Next up, you need to download Odin 3 from the link in the description. Odin 3 is a flashing software which is used to install the Android 6 firmware. Now it's time to get the model number of your device to download the appropriate firmware of Android 6. Go to settings, then go to about device, and then here you should see model number. As you can see, mine is SMG930F. So now I'm going back to my computer to show you the next steps. Now it's time to go ahead and download the Android 6 firmware. In my case, I use some mobile, but you can also use Boycraft. To make things easier, make sure to sign up or log in to some mobile before using it. Next, navigate to firmware and type your model number that you've seen previously on your phone. Please ensure that you type the correct model number, otherwise you may break your device permanently. Next, select the country where you bought the device, in my case is United Kingdom. Next, choose one of those versions, it doesn't really matter which one you're gonna choose, in my case I chose the latest one. After that, check all those information about this firmware and then click on download. So after performing those steps, now it's time for the big step. It's time to downgrade our device back to Android 6. So how you do this? You first need to power off your device by holding down your power button. And after it's completely off, then you need to hold down the power button, the home button, and the volume down button. Okay, so after you see this exact screen, you need to press the volume up in order to access the download mode. And now you need to take your device cable and connect it to your computer. After that, go ahead and launch Odin. With Odin 3, we're going to put the files, make up the whole firmware in the correct place, depending on the starting letters, starting with the BL. As you can see, I selected the firmware which starts with BL, next with AP, or the AP, next with CP. And finally, the one which starts with CSC. This is the most important step because if you do a mistake, you may ruin your device forever. So please go ahead and check again if the starting letters of the files that you just inserted start with the correct letters according to the checkboxes. After that, go ahead and click Start. Then you need to wait until all of the files have been downloaded on your device. When it's done downloading, you're gonna see a password on the top left box. At that time, you may disconnect your device from your computer and then wait until everything is installed on your device. Then follow all of the instructions and after that enjoy your device with Android 6.0.1. That brings to the end of this video. I hope you find this video helpful. Please make sure to hit the like button if you like this video. Drop a comment to let me know what you think about this video and if you have any question, share this video to other people. And of course, if you're a new visitor to this channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button to see other videos like that. Thanks for watching and as always I'm going to see you in my next video.